pound of feathers or a pound of weight, like a pound of weight, which is heavier? A pound. That's the thing, it's still a pound. It still weighs a pound. It still measures a pound. If I'm living in the midst, I don't care if I'm living in the midst of the jungle, I'm living in the midst of people that love me, I'm living in the midst of church, I'm living in the midst of my own apartment. I am living in the midst. I was living in the midst of Jonathan Street. I am I, living in the midst. In the midst is still the midst. In the midst is still the middle. In the midst is still the middle of the sea. It's like at midnight, Paul and Silas prayed. I don't care where you were standing. Peter was doing one thing. Paul was in chains. James um, was he James was dead. But everybody was doing something at that time. But because Paul and Silas were in prison at midnight, midnight still looked like midnight. Midnight was still midnight. It doesn't matter what you are doing. It doesn't matter what classifies what comes behind the word midnight does not change what midnight looks like but midnight still is midnight and at midnight at midnight in the middle of the sea in the middle of the sea and here I'm in the midst I'm in the midst of people that love me but I'm still in the midst my bed is in the middle of the wonderful situation because I mean, the, the little boy is 13 so he gave up his bed for me He showed me a picture of his room yesterday because we went to his um we, we switched up, we went to the grandparents' house yesterday. And he showed me a picture of his room. He said, Jane, he said, I said, is that your bed? He said, yeah. I said, so I'm laying on your bed. I said, that's small. He said, yeah. I said, I'm gonna hurry up and get off your bed. He said, no, 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 I snatched a picture of it. He said, you stay as long as you want, you stay as long as you want. I was 11, excuse me. He said, you stay as long as you want, you stay as long as you want. No, I'm fine. He said, I actually have an air mattress too, don't worry about that. Parents wait on me hand and foot. It makes me want to rip my hair out. In fact, I do anything besides go to the bathroom. It's like they're going to put me on house arrest inside their house. They do everything. It's amazing. That's exactly what I need. Crazy. 
from me and they took me to the uh, ER. So some of y'all, they are not gonna know how to before you can walk to your reads. You're trying to walk in your reads, get the things redone and uh, reassessed and realigned and uh, re-justified. I had an assist from God because he allowed a sis to get to me. Yes, I'm still taking painkillers from it. It's from my phone because here's the thing. Uh, I, I take the painkillers and I swell in it, it, right? Why? Because I, I need to get to my reads. I need to find out of my reads. I need to God to adjust my reads. I need to know that things are going on inside of my body. Ain't nobody got to do anything. Hit their body and God ain't with them. Come on! So, challenge! Do somebody. Sit down. Hallelujah to Jesus. So anyway, here's the thing. I'm trying to get to my reads. But sometimes you can't make it to your reads if you never make it to the ER. One more time. I, I, some people miss that. Sometimes you can never get to your reads of uh, ministries. You'll never make it to your reads if you cannot get to the ER. Uh, get to that timeline there. Some of you uh, will not go to the ER and get fixed uh, uh, proportionately. Get fixed medically. Let God work on you medically. You'll never get there uh, because you will not uh, accept the fact that God wants to fix you, work on you. Uh, you never accept the fact that God wants to do it for you. And so you never see your reads the uh, RE because you won't go to the ER of oh, God. And let me miss the ER of it. So you, uh, because you missed the ER, you uh, read it up, don't you? Say, Lord, if you kill the hand of God, find you right now. By the way, happy independence day for John 10, 9, and 10. Uh, that's the best scripture I can give for it. I got the glory anyway. Hallelujah, I give to God. I snatch the glory and I give to him. See, sometimes we have to get to the ER for her, so we have a testimony about it, so that we can take that to the hallelujah the restore. They talk about the restore, uh, and a lot of funny thing about the restore is that the restore here, you get things from re, you get things that have been used, and so the re's have all been used. So you can put the to play your house with all the re's, uh, so you can uh, get your own stuff right here. This is re's. And it's a re-store, right? We go to a store. Let's go to the re-store. The re-store is a store that um, you have a chance to use this again. It's a re-store, but not too many people see the element of that. Not only do you get stuff that has been used, but you get stuff that wants to be used again. And the re-store allows you to restore some stuff. You remember, I worked out of to put some, put some, put some extra upholstery on some stuff. You put, put some extra carpeting on some stuff. You gotta put some extra cloth on some stuff. You gotta, uh, put some um, extra coffee on some stuff. You don't have to restore the elements that God, uh, oh God, that God wants to take you into. God wants to bless you with so that you can become the season of richness and abundance. So people see God in you. You become the picture of the restore. 